In practice it exercise 2.4 star square we are asked to write for loops to produce the following output so we're gonna need a for loop in case inside of another for loop what we're gonna do on our outside for loop is look at how many rows we have we can see that we have four rows and then we can see how many stars are in each row in our nested loop First, we're going to look at our outside loop. We have four int i is equal to zero, and then we're going to run this as long as i is less than, and then we see how many rows we have. We have four rows, so i is less than four, and this is going to run for i plus plus, or, um, and then we are going to go inside of our for loop. We're going to have a, another for loop inside of here so we'll have four and this is going to print out how many stars we have so we're going to say j is equal to zero then we do j is less than how many stars are in our row we have five stars in one row so we'll do less than five and then we're going to do j plus plus to get through this and we will write actually we need um brackets along here and then in here we need a system dot out dot prints and since it's on the same line, we're not going to do an ln. We're just going to leave it at print. And in here, we'll have a star. And then after it breaks out of this middle, this enclosed, this nested loop, that means we are done with one row. So we are going to have to print out a new line. So we'll write system dot out dot print line like this. And we will not include a star in here. We're just going to print out a line. And if we press submit, we have passed the test.